Good morning guys and welcome to Iceland day two. Today uh, we will be renting our car. That is actually where my parents are at the moment. So today we will be driving from Reykjavik to Hella. I don't actually know how to say that. It's H-E-L-L-A, so to me it looks like Hella, but I think the double L's is actually a different thing in Icelandic. I don't know what sound it makes, but whatever that town is, we will be driving there. And we will be stopping through lots of national parks and I think we're gonna see waterfalls and geysers and all that kind of cool stuff. So I am excited for that. Also, if you guys can tell, I am in a different room than I was before. I ended up switching rooms with my brother and so I am in this room with my mom. So I'll show you guys around just a little bit. I will say it's extremely messy, so um, ignore that. I need to pack up all of my stuff, but it just has this cute little seating area here. Here's the door, it's basically just Pretty basic room. This is the bed. Again, European beds are usually two really small beds put together. There's this mirror over here. I am apparently going for the tree look today. I've got my brown pants that are too long for my short legs. And then I've got this green top. Yeah, that's it. And then in here, we just have another simple bathroom. Yeah, that's it. Another small little shower. Yep. And the view is pretty much the same as before. You can tell these curtains do not really do much. And in Iceland, the sun does not set. We were probably all in bed for at least 12 hours last night, but I only got like a few hours of sleep. Even though I was exhausted from the plane ride and not sleeping the night before, I slept for about an hour initially, but then I woke up and my mom was snoring. Sorry, mom, <laughs> I'm gonna call you out. And then I did not get back to sleep until like 2.30 or so in the morning. And by the way, even at 2.30 in the morning, it's still light outside. And these curtains really don't do much to block the light. So that's one thing to note if you're going to Iceland, to make sure you have really good eye shades and make sure they're comfortable. And yeah, hopefully you can get some sleep even when it's light out. Another thing to note, especially if any of you guys are interested in coming to Iceland in June, is that it's much colder than I expected it to be. Sure, I knew it was going to be a little bit chilly. I mean, I am practically in the Arctic. But the weather said like high 40s, low 50s. But I would say it's more like high 20s, low 30s. And this is all Fahrenheit. So I'm probably going to end up buying a hat somewhere soon because my ears are always freezing. And again, it's just much colder than I thought it was going to be. But yeah, that's pretty much it on my updates. Um, I'm excited to go and see what we have today. I think I'm going to go bug my brother soon and see if they wanna go get some breakfast. I also need to pack up all of my stuff and then we will be heading out shortly. So yeah, today should be exciting. I think it's only about a three hour drive, but there's going to be lots of stops in between. So I will see you guys there. Here is our rental car. Hey Cameron, it's a nine seater van. Look at all that room. All right, let's go. currently in Thingvalar National Park or something. There's my family back there. <laughs> and we're walking along this path right now, seeing where it takes us. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Here, here's the view. There's interesting rock things like that here. And here's this little path. Oh, it just goes out here, I think. I'm not really sure. Go to the middle of the earth. 
card. Drop the pebble down it. See how deep it is. Yeah, yeah, okay. I want to drop my phone down there. Oh no, I see a bottom down there. Yeah, kind of. Some, Maybe. <gasps> oh man, I'm about. It's what? Soft. Oh yeah. <laughs> you don't want to fall in. I know. Yeah. You see the cracks right next to it? Yeah, I know. It's cracking all around. Can we see down there? It's like the tiny version of what we just walked through. <laughs> Back to our ugly French car. I don't think this is great. <laughs> I'm in the candy aisle, and what are these? Lobra larva? Like, what is that? What are they doing? Are they dancing? I have no idea. It looks disgusting. <laughs> so now we're at a place with a bunch of geysers. Is it called geyser? So true. Yes. Okay, we're at a place called geyser. Wait, really? Yes. Mm -hmm. Wait, because of this town? Yeah. Because of this geothermal area. <gasps> oh, that's. Cool. It just went off and we missed it. The term geyser. The term for geyser. The, the geological thing came from the town here called Geyser. Right. Or at least this area called Geyser. Okay. Not that this place was named Geyser after all the geysers that were here. Correct. I think that's interesting. That is neat, yeah. Okay. Should we go over there? I don't know. We're gonna miss it. If we you know, do. I'd like to set my camera to record uh, just before it goes, but I don't know when it goes. I know. I don't know when it goes. Here. Wanna go get a better shot of it? Okay. Oh. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I still got it. Let's go to the other side and see. Oh, you think it did it look like yeah. that before? Yeah. Or does it I think so. Dirty? Okay. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna try this again, but from the other side. <laughs> Woo! Uh oh! Oh! <laughs> wow! Woo! Oh, that's that's a uh, smelly. <laughs> Ooh, warm. <laughs> it was like right as I dropped my phone though. <laughs> you dropped your phone? <laughs> I it. Of course. I fumbled it at that moment, but that at least you're cool. recording it, so. I think you... <laughs> I think I need to clean my camera lens. Okay, look at the... I gotta sit like here until the geyser goes off, so. <laughs> Okay, you guys are ridiculous. <laughs> Hey, you're the one who's <laughs> Okay, yeah, true. Good point. Now we're at a place called Gullfoss, and you can see, like, a whole glacier along here. I'll show you guys. Do you see the glacier and the horizon? All that white, like there's white on top of the mountains and that's the glacier. Look at that, that's so cool. Hey guys, so we just got to our second hotel room here in Iceland and this place is really cool It's like a guest house and we have our own like little hut thing So I'll go ahead and show you guys what it looks like. Here's what it looks like on the outside There's four little huts. There's one here one right here that me and my mom are staying in 
One over there. Hi, mom. <laughs> Wait, let me zoom in. Hi. <laughs> and then that one past there, my other brother is staying in. And then you come inside here. And there's this little cute little kitchen and living room space. I was going to try to show it all to you before we made too much of a mess of it, but we've already kind of made a mess of things. Right here is a kitchen. Let's see. Whoa. Is this a stove? What happens if I... Okay, pressing things doesn't seem to do anything, so I'm not totally sure what this is. Wait, does it move? No. Is this a stove? Someone please tell me. And down here, our ooh, there's silverware. Let's see what's in the rest of these. Oh, a cutting board and stuff like that, some coasters, some pots and pans. This whole cute little like kitchenette thing. Ooh, a fridge. Okay, okay. Probably, oh, there is stuff there. Trash cans. A little sink, some more little cabinets up here. And then you turn this way and there's a little seating area with a couch and a chair and a little coffee table. And then right over here are the two beds. So me and my mom will be staying here in this one. There's also a TV. And then back here behind the beds again, when you first come to the door and if you go to the left, there's the bathroom. Again, pretty basic. There's a sink, a toilet, a shower. There we go. And then probably the coolest part is over here. You gotta see this awesome view out here. <laughs> yes, I see you. <laughs> you trying to scare me? <laughs> when you turn around with your video and you just... <laughs> oh. Like, yeah, good try. Like a scary face, but... Yeah. I see mom. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see me? I'm gonna try to go scare her. Okay, ready? Boo! Oh, jeez. <laughs> Did that kind of scare you? No. no, you just said, oh, jeez. Okay, now I'm going back out here. <laughs> so this is the view, like I was saying earlier. Lots of nice green open space, very different from our last hotel, which was in a much more industrial part of Reykjavik. Apparently there's a glacier and stuff over here, but we can't really see it because of the clouds, so maybe that'll clear up a little bit more tomorrow. So it's just this whole little porch area with some chairs and a little table. And then over here are the two huts that the rest of my family is staying in. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> so this is what it looks like from the outside. How's it going over there? Good. What, are you eating something? Oh. Coffee? Are you having coffee at 8 p.m. at night? Oh, wine. Okay, you're having wine at 8 p.m. <laughs> and it's still nice and bright out, and it's gonna be like this all night. Okay, now I'll go back inside. Is there anyone in here that's gonna scare me? <laughs> Alright you guys, tomorrow should be pretty exciting. We're going to be leaving here and driving about three and a half hours to an ice lagoon and then we're doing a, like a zodiac tour of that. And we will be driving back here and staying the night one more time in this guest house. Okay, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this here. If you guys want to see the ice lagoon tour and all of that, be sure to stay tuned for the next vlog. And yeah, I will see you guys then. Alright, bye!